Welcome to Sword Box Ministries. Thanks for checking out our Thursday message. Nikki continues with the story of Joseph in today's video. Our verse for today is Proverbs 1-5. The wise man will hear and increase learning, and a man of understanding will attain wise counsel. Welcome back. I hope you've been enjoying our series on Joseph. <clears throat> Yesterday we saw Joseph interpret the dreams of Pharaoh. The dreams told of a near future uh, where there would be a horrible famine and it was a warning from God. These dreams would no doubt be troubling to Pharaoh as they foretold of a very, very serious famine that would affect all of Egypt and in fact would affect all of the world. But not only did God give Joseph the ability to interpret the dreams, he also gave Joseph wisdom to know how to respond to them. In Genesis 41:33, it says, Now therefore, this is Joseph speaking, Now therefore, let Pharaoh select a discerning and wise man, and set, and set him over the land of Egypt. Let Pharaoh do this, and let him appoint officers over the land to collect one-fifth of the produce of the land of the Egypt in the seven plentiful years. And let them gather all the food of those good years that are coming, and store up grain under the authority of Pharaoh, and let them keep food in the cities. Then that food shall be as a reserve for the land for the seven years of famine which shall be in the land of Egypt, that the land may not perish during the famine. You know, at this point, if Pharaoh would have been arrogant and prideful, he might have told Joseph to back off. He might have told him to take him right back to prison. I mean, Joseph was just a Hebrew slave who was a prisoner. Interpreting dreams is one thing, but telling the king how to run his kingdom, well, that's quite another. However, Pharaoh did not respond that way at all. Genesis 41:37 tells his response. So the advice was good in the eyes of Pharaoh and in the eyes of his servants. And Pharaoh said to his servants, Can we find such a man as this in whom is the Spirit of God? Wow, what a response by Pharaoh. The moving of God's spirit in Joseph and the wisdom that God was giving him was evident to all of those who were there. You know, Proverbs 1.5 says, A wise man will hear and increase learning, and a man of understanding will attain wise counsel. And Pharaoh was certainly wise to listen to the words of Joseph and to the spirit of God. I hope you in your life will take time to seek wise counsel and to... The wisest counsel you're ever going to find is in the Word of God. But certainly, none of us completely and fully understand all of God's Word. So make sure when you're making big decisions, you're praying about it and you're seeking wise counsel. God bless you.